What is up guys, Austin Urcho here back again playing Jurassic World Evolution, continuing on with our gameplay here through like I guess the story or whatever along the islands on Isla Pena, of course the horrible island. So I've made a lot of upgrades since the last uh, uh, time we, or the last time I recorded I should say, or the last video you saw. Um, so we've made a bunch of changes. So over here we've added a uh, fast food place just for some reason and then um, viewing platform. So I've completely closed all of this area off here into a fence. And so it's housed all of these things, the Gallimimus, Struthiomimus, and Arctheornithomimus and stuff there just because they're small animals that can fit in there. Over here I had a Ceratosaurus. I don't, can't remember if I've showed you guys that or not or if I even had this built in the last episode. Um, but now I have a Baryonyx because Baryonyx has much higher rating and the Ceratosaurus was just being annoying and stuff. Then I closed off this area in here and put viewing platforms so this is open now to put dinos in. Don't know what I'll fit in here but there is. Then I put in two new fences over here to put dinos in so we got a heavy fence so probably for a carnivore or something and I then you know lighter delivered. fence so put some herbivores in there. We have the big open one so I got rid of the Diplodocus because I was want to use this for the mission we're doing the day and so i need to move and it wouldn't fit in either one of these it wouldn't be happy so um i just had to get rid of it and then over here i made a little fence and didn't know what to put in but i put in an anky so we have a anky and we'll put more stuff like the anky type things in there as well once we get more money and everything going on park by put in another hotel more power um, put in another ranger station to help you know cure stuff because I just actually got done having a tornado and the Baryonyx apparently broke out the tornado was all the way over here destroying all this fence and stuff but then all of a sudden the Baryonyx broke out of there so I have this area open in here and in here to put more dinos in if I need to uh, but I think building wise we're pretty much all the way done unless we need more power but it looks like we have a lot of power yeah left going because of an up we got one of the upgrades but let's go ahead and look at our missions for the day. So yeah, I think in here, yeah, I got the improved output research done trying to get to our mission for today. And I also completed the bar. Oh, looks like we just have a little bit for security. So we need to get up our entertainment to unlock that mission and then just do a little bit on there. Oh, it looks like more than just a little bit. But we've got a lot of bunch of stuff to unlock on here. So let's go ahead. Oh no, that's where I needed to be. My bad. So I need to go in here. And I actually, there we go. I was like, I forgot how to do this. So here we have to incubate, which I have 100% on all of these. So we're going to do four more Gallimimus, which is fine. Two Chasmosaurs, a Dionychus, and a Metria, which the Metria and Dionychus can live together. And then um, the Chasmosaur and Gallimimus, we won't put together, put the Gallimimus with the others. But I think over here... So yeah, it says fail if any of our killed. So we'll do the uh, herbivores first. And then I, it says they don't have to be contained. Yeah, it says within separate. So we'll go ahead and start the mission. Great. And Dr. Duo will talk to us. Break down into herbivores and, and I'm hoping I have enough money to do all this. So let's go ahead and do... Not so much. Our goal is to get them isolated I somewhat have a feeling... We'll go and do the... Gallimimus's first. First step, we need to hatch our new what dinosaurs and set is our thing going to be success? Enough to tell them apart. Here's a helpful tip: the ones we trying to have bite three unlocked. Not vegan. Shoot. Um. I'll go successor. I'll just have to. This is going to take quite a while, but I'll go ahead and I guess get the Gallimimus's done. We can do two of them which those should go pretty fast and so those will incubate and I'll bring them back um, back and we'll I guess I'll do all four Gallimimus first and then bring them back then we'll do the Chasmosaurs which I've not had in a park yet I'll probably put the Chasmosaurs over here um, but I've not had them in a park yet so I have a feeling they're gonna need more than two for some reason but they are trike type things so maybe not not sure but usually that's how it goes like they only seems like it only needs a few but then you have to have a lot more um but i will get the gallimimus and i'll come back do the chasm and just bring it back every time we do a new one so i will see you once the gallimimuses are done so all the gallimimuses are now out so we'll go ahead and just start doing the chasmosaurs now like i said i'm hoping this doesn't like completely like kill my bank account Ugh, that would be bad. So let's go ahead and knock all of these out. Acknowledged. 
Adding task. So that way we can move them out of this con enclosure, I guess you could say. I want to take this contract, which means we can't you even reach to that thing. Correct? So I'm gonna decline. Um, so yeah, we got the those going down now, and we've got the Cosmosaurs. So I guess once they get done, I'll bring it back once again. And of course, these will be moved out into the other pin. So I will see you then. Okay, so the last Gallimimus is now being transported out. So let's go ahead and release our Chasmosaurs here. And like I said, let's hope that they don't need more than two. Which, it, I mean, it's fine if they do. But um, I'm hoping not because I don't want to spend the more money on them. So let's take a look once the stats pop up here. What its requirement is. There we go. So yeah, it does have a low social three. So again, you have to do more than what it says. So let's go ahead and get another one going, I guess. Wasting the money on it. Didn't want to do that, but that's what they require, which is not fun. So now I'm going to get the other Chasmosaur done. I'm going to move them over into this pin area here. So I'll have all three, of course, we'll have the two done. But we need one more because they... It's like, why can't they just do times three? Just so it helps you out and everything. But we got to do another one now. So I'll get that moved over and then we'll do the Matriacanthosaurus and Dionychus. I want to say together, but I think the Dionychus needs more than one. I, now that I think about it, not exactly sure, but I'll see what it is. But I will probably do just two Dionychus and then the Matria just to do that. Who's got a disease? Oh, the Baryonyx. You a sick dino, you poor little dino. Medicate you and then resupply your food. So I will get that going and bring it back once the chasmosaurs are moved over into this pin. So I will see you then. Okay, so the chasmosaurs have been transported over here finally and they all almost started attacking the fins. But let's go into the Dionychus and we are, hopefully, if we have money, I say gonna go ahead and do two. That's like all my money. I may have to sit and wait. What about the. Um, what was. Is it the Matriacanthosaurus, I think it was? Oh no, that's like all my money too. Yeah, Matriacanthosaurus. Um, it's like, which one do I do? Um, I'll just go ahead and do the two Dionychus waste all of... Actually, I don't think... I, yeah, I don't even have the money to do another one. I'll have to sit here and wait, but I'll wait and get both of those. And hopefully, because our money is going up quite a bit. Um, because of adding the, these new dinos and everything. Is everyone becoming healthy again? The one was pretty angry. At least both science ones. Yeah, it looks like they're all doing good now. But yeah, hopefully I'll may be making more money and stuff and get it up to a good price. But I have both, both Dionychus. I'm trying to decide if I just want to leave them in here for now. Until, you know, I get this mission done. Or if I want to just go ahead and move them over. Not exactly sure, but I'll do something. I'll just see what the Dionychus requires and everything, and hopefully we can get the money back. Yep, still don't have enough. Have to sit here for a little bit, but I will get those done and then uh, release those. And then once the, I think the Matriacanthosaurus is done, I will then bring it back at some point. So I'll see you then. Okay, so I just got done with the storm, so we got a whole bunch of stuff going on. Looks like most of it's repaired by now. But I went ahead and did the Matria because the Dionychus requires three. So I didn't have enough money. So I'm going to release this because of its rating and everything. will help, you know, increase money amounts and everything. So it'll help, you know, get more money faster to do more Dionychus. Some amazing work. So... I don't know what I completed besides just that part. I don't know what I meant. So it looks like it is fine in this place for now. So hopefully that'll increase our money and everything. Is the Baryonyx doing okay up here? Okay. Because the storm, it, the guy came on and said something about uh, being like issues or whatever with dinos being angry because the storms and stuff. So I wanted to make sure. So now let's check for... We don't even have enough money to do another Dionychus, which looks like it just popped up there. So it looks like we're going to have to wait to get this one 
going, I can go ahead and start that one, I guess, just so we can get two done at least. And hopefully, like I said, the Matria will help bring in more money and our finances will go up. Oh yeah, we're up to over 200,000 now. It was at just under 200 before, so he has helped quite a bit. So hopefully that'll get our money charging through even faster so then we can get the other Dionychus done and finish off this mission. So once I get all the Dionychus ready to release, which of course I don't have... I'll have to, I wish I had that three done, but I may just go ahead and risk it and do another one just so I can, you know, when the time comes and I have the money, I can just do all three. So I don't have to hopefully worry about breaking out or anything, but I will get all of the Dionychus released at one time, hopefully, and I'll bring it back once. Um, ah, that's not what I wanted to happen. Oh crap. Um, I hate when that happens, so I'm going to have to do success rate, which sucks. Okay. Now I have to sit and wait for that one to come up to do another Dionychus. So I will see you once I get all of the Dionychus up and ready and get my money going. So I'll see you then. And finally, after waiting all this time, I've gotten all three done. So this last one, I kind of just upped its rating of viability. Oh god, what has the disease? I almost killed the dinos over here on accident because um, I forgot the feeder I put in here was um, a carnivore one because I had put the ceratosaurus over here to see if it would live early. So I'd put that and forgot that and I just, you know, like, oh, there's a feeder. It should be fine. And forgotten dino almost died and almost ruined the whole mission. But let's go ahead now and release all of the Dionychuses. And... I don't remember what, what color I chose on it. It doesn't look too good though, whatever, it, at least in this light. Who knows? What is it? Um, where does it? It says it somewhere. Oh, alpine pattern, I guess is what it is. This is one of our biggest challenges. These animals, even when we keep them separated, they know. They each know that the other is there. Predator and prey. Okay, so those are fine, so I gotta go... The other in fear. It's a powder keg just waiting for a spark. I gotta go find... Are they fine with everything? Yeah, forest, grassland, all Perhaps that stuff. Perhaps you will succeed where others before you have failed. But as you learn... So do they. So it should they run away, I believe, hopefully. It. And, of course, because so I think, because yeah, it says I'm sure they can live in in house together. Okay, so now I thought that'd be the end of the mission, but now I gotta go find <laughs> all the. I forget what they even were. Galmimuses. Oh shoot, I may have to write it down. So seven, Galmimus seven, five, I assume seven, five, and six. Oh no, seven, five, six, is it four? Four, five, six, and seven, okay. So yeah, it's four. Yeah, I'm minus Understood. six. Five and seven. There we Task go. Received. Should be all those, hopefully. Okay, so now I just gotta wait for them to get knocked out, and surely all these guys are doing fine. I may need to put another feeder down. Put one down there and put some more water. Just so the Maitreya doesn't scare them off and not allow them to eat. So they should all be good now running around like crazy. Now I just got to move these and I got to move them into here. Like I said, I wish I would have known that. I would have put them there in the first place. 
Oh shoot, what was that? No, I need a Gallimimus. Did I miss the wrong one? Struthio, Gallimimus 2, Gallimimus 1. Arctheo, Arky, Gallimimus 3, 4, 5, 6. Arctheo, I hit for some reason. So got one, two, three, and four. And accidentally hit that Arctheo, whatever, on accident. Okay, Gallimimus. Transport you over. En route to collect the asset. Uh, this will take quite a while. I wish there was a way to like asset speed up uh, the movement of dinos because it seems like this takes forever. Acknowledging asset collection and request. the last one. And then I'll have to move that Arctheo just back around. Asset requiring collection. In the base there, yeah, Arctheo. Request Just move it there. Okay, so now I'm gonna get all these transported. Transporting asset. Oh yeah, cause they're going out like that. Okay, so I'm gonna get all these transported and then I'll bring them back and that should probably be the end of the mission and the lead to the end of our episode, I would believe. So hopefully we'll see in just a second. Asset. And I'll get them transported and we will see, so I'll see you then. Okay, so the last one just got delivered over here, so it should be... If this isn't the worst case, it's oh my goodness, close. we've got all sorts of disease spreading through the diseases. And we need to get a handle on it immediately. Need I None remind of these you happen? of the investment you're putting at risk by letting this disease spread? Letting a disease spread, that's not what we're doing. So we got, of course, all those going on there. Don't let our sick dinos die. So we had a Chasmosaur and two Gallimimuses. I'll just add the other team as well. Adding task. Just to see who will do it first. So it looks like one's already done and healthy. Now we got the Chasmosaur and other Gallimimus. Look at all the people it's driving through. So of course now our money's going up pretty good because we've gotten pretty good, yeah, profit over three hundred thousand now. <laughs> Randing into the water, and there, so they should both be finishing that off, and we should be good. I've just been watching the. Oh, now it's this one. Reaching an epidemic, the disease is spreading. Confirming task. Good thing we didn't use all of our things. So should yeah, all those dinos are good now. Now we got to do the carnivores. Need like put the gate right there or something, but I don't think you can. I think it's too close to that. Pretty sure. Yeah, obstructed. Stop being obstructed. Driving through the water. Going off road. There, that one's cured. Now it's got to do the Dionychus. Hopefully you got good aim. I've got you the best aim possible. Oh, there we go. And we did it. We finished the mission finally. This has been a long mission. Mostly just because of the money issue. We got the Tundra. Woohoo. You know, that's real special. But we've done it, okay. so that's going to be as it. Was it. There for a minute, it looks like the fire is out. Yes, the fire the is out. Has been contained. Now, we though, no I can finally incubate my other Baryonyx to go up in here. Because I want two Baryonyx in this park. If I can finally get that going. And that's going to be it for this episode today. So I hope you enjoyed this episode of Jurassic World Evolution. Not, you know, too exciting stuff. Just kept incubating a bunch of dinos. Had to sit and wait for all my money to gather up, which took forever. It's been probably two hours 
just doing this one video with short clips and everything so it's been pretty boring but i hope you enjoyed this episode i really enjoy playing this game so it's absolutely so much fun every time i get to do it so i hope you enjoy it as well and sharing the fun with me but i thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you did and leave any comments you have for me down below thank you for watching and we'll see you next time